In the heart of Eastern Europe, during the tumultuous 15th century, a figure of high controversy and undying legend was born. The era was one of conflict, with the Ottoman Empire expanding its reach and the small kingdoms of Europe straining under the pressure. This was the stage upon which Vlad the Impaler, voivode of Wallachia, would make his dramatic entrance. Vlad III, also known as Vlad the Impaler or Vlad Dracula, was born in Sigisaur, Transylvania in 1431. His father, Vlad Sekth Dracul, was a member of the Order of the Dragon, a chivalric order dedicated to halting the Ottoman advance into Europe. From this association, Vlad III adopted the epithet Dracula, meaning son of the dragon. Vlad's reign was characterized by constant warfare against the Ottomans, as well as internal struggles with the boyars, Romanian nobility often accused of disloyalty. His first period of rule began in 1448, but it was short-lived. After two months, Vlad was forced into exile. However, this setback did not deter the young ruler. He regained the throne in 1456, marking the beginning of his main reign. It was during this time that Vlad's reputation for unspeakable cruelty began to spread. His preferred method of execution, impalement, earned him the moniker, the Impaler. However, beneath the blood-soaked tales of terror, there was a ruler striving for the autonomy and prosperity of his realm. Vlad implemented strict laws to restore order, improve economy, and reduce crime. He also fortified cities and castles to defend against Ottoman invasions. Vlad's reign came to an end in 1476. His death is shrouded in mystery, with various theories suggesting he died in battle, was assassinated, or even fell victim to his own trap. His body was reportedly buried at Snagov Monastery near Bucharest. Vlad's legacy on Romania is complex. He is vilified in many Western accounts for his brutal tactics. Yet, in Romania, he is often viewed as a hero, a staunch defender of his homeland against the Ottoman threat. His rule was a time of stability and growth for Wallachia, despite the surrounding chaos. Vlad the Impaler also left a significant cultural footprint. His association with the Order of the Dragon and his infamous cruelty inspired Bram Stoker's legendary character, Count Dracula. This connection has made Transylvania a focal point for vampire lore and a popular tourist destination. In the end, Vlad the Impaler's life and reign are a testament to the turbulent history of Romania. His story, fraught with conflict and controversy, continues to captivate audiences worldwide. It serves as a reminder of a time when kingdoms rose and fell, leaders fought with unyielding determination, and legends were born from the crucible of history.